One of my awesome subscribers by the name of Kevin Wicks told me about Swiss Chalet's Kickin' Crispy Chicken. He says he thinks it's a go out and get it now. Let's see for ourselves. Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to the Ken Dominic Food Review, just for you and just for you. Like I said, Kevin Wicks told me about this Kickin' Crispy Chicken from Swiss Chalet, which is a chain of restaurants right across the great country of Canada. Right now I'm in Barrie, Ontario, Canada, to try it out for myself to see if Kevin was right. And it comes with a whole bunch of different sides if you want. You can have uh, the two piece chicken dinner with a side. And I didn't really want any of the other sides. I just, I'm just here for the chicken. Let's check this out, people. Are you ready? Very nice packaging, wouldn't you agree? Then that was my double fries with sauce, the Swiss chalet sauce. She asked me if I wanted condiments, if I wanted so other sauces, so I went with uh, and utensils. So I asked her for Frank's hot sauce. Now I'm thinking the whole idea of it being kicking crispy chicken is that it's got a spice to it already. So we're gonna try it without Frank's Red and then with Frank's Red. Are you ready? Let's dig in. I had to go in for backup napkins. I think I'm gonna need them. All right, here we go. First time looking at the kicking crispy chicken from Swiss Chalet. Was it good? Does it look good? Can you smell that? Wow. Oh, that smells so good. It does, it does smell like KFC's chicken but I bet it's completely different. Are you ready? Scratch it, sniff it. I bet the rest is mine. This is the Swiss Chalet special sauce. It is their Swiss Chalet sauce. I don't know what it is. A lot of people love this so much. At the end of their meal, after dipping their fries, after dipping their chicken, they will drink this sauce. They gave me a white bun, two pieces of chicken, the sauce, this crazy huge ass thing of fries. I'm not sure if that's gravy or more sauce. Yeah, so it's more of the Swiss Chalet sauce. Like I said, we're just gonna, you know what? Let's do a quick sample of their fries. A little soggy, but that's the way they like them. Mmm. Swiss Chalet fries are unpeeled, deep fried to perfection. So let's dip it in the Swiss Chalet sauce. Oh, drippity drip. Nice. Mm. I like their gravy or the sauce that they have. Again, if you work at Swiss Chalet, leave a comment in the comment section below as to what you know the sauce actually is. Because I have no idea. Let's get into this chicken as quickly as possible because I want to find out if it's kicking or not. So there you go. Look good to you? Does it look good to you guys over there? Oh my. Super crunchy, fresh chicken, cooked to perfection, moist chicken. The breading is very savory, not hot, spicy. It would be so cool if they actually upped it a notch and uh, tried it with some crazy hot breading. But it's not spicy at all, like what you're thinking it's gonna be when they use the word kicking. But this is the first time in many, many, many years that Swiss Chalet has changed up or added something like this to their recipe or to their menu. So let's put on a little bit of hot sauce. Okay, here we go. Frank's Red Hot on there. And what's missing is pickles. Mmm. The Frank's Hot definitely adds a nice flavor, a nice kick to it. Let's put some more on there. Mmm. Mm-hmm. A little more right there. Wow. But you heard that, an, that first initial bite of the crunch and then that whole side came off. 
like an avalanche into my mouth. Let's go in for another bite, because that is brilliant Swiss Chalet. Nice. Mmm. Mmm. You know when you're super hungry, and you bite into really good food, and your mouth and your body just makes that mmm noise? I do it all the time, as you guys know. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to go in for that super duper hunger alert for anybody who's watching this at any time of the day. Oh, the chicken fell right into it. I'm going to need some help here. Screw it. I'm going in. Oh, ow, it's hot. It's hot. Not bad. I like the Swiss chalet sauce, but on their rotisserie chicken, I need to clean up. All right, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, as you guys know, Ken Domic is always starving, so I'm gonna polish this off, so hang on. Holy cow, there is so much chicken. Let's continue. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Two points for Ken for eating two huge pieces of deep fried chicken. Those were big. Woo! All right, ladies and gentlemen, on my rating scale, I am going to give that. I would not recommend eating it in your car. That was uh, very greasy, uh, eating it with your hands. I suggest you eat it with, your, with a knife and fork if you don't want to get greasy all over your hands in your car and then go to like a business meeting or something. Maybe just wash your hands afterwards. That would be a good idea. Uh, but on my rating scale, guys, the actual chicken itself is a go out and get it now. Very well done, Swiss Chalet. I'm pretty sure the next time I come here with the family, I'll be ordering, ordering the kicking crispy chicken uh, two piece, maybe just one piece, because that was a lot of food. Uh, what I ordered right now would do two people no problem whatsoever. And I forgot to also talk about the bill. It was $12.99 for those two huge chi chickens, two sauces, double the fries. Again, I could have had other sides with it. They even have like jalapeno mashed potatoes. I should have given them a shot, shouldn't I? And then after taxes and everything, it came to $14.68. Uh, so for $12.99, you can, again, split that whole thing with somebody. You can ask for maybe two uh, breasts of chicken, because that was like a chicken and a thigh kind of thing. I really liked the thigh, but the, the breast of chicken was so big and round and had so much breading on it, I enjoyed that probably a little bit more because I had a lot of uh, crispy chicken in the, every single bite. All right, guys. If you enjoy these videos and you do not want to miss the next one, make sure you hit the subscribe button. It is right there like usual. But if you enjoyed watching me eat deep fried chicken in my car in Barrie, Ontario, Canada, hit the like button, ding, 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 and we'll see you next time on another Ken Domic Food Review. Ken Domic out. Told me about the new crispy. What is it called? I had to go in for backup napkins. I wasn't even looking at you. I apologize. I almost forgot to do the one o'clock in the morning shadow bite. That was kind of sad. It was kind of sad. As you know, I'm starving. As I spit, it's time to polish this off. I spit again. It's hot. Wow. No, oh, no. Chicken on my. Tummy. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.